Hello, I'm the Asian Dumbledore, and today... <laughs> and uh, can we just talk about how oily my forehead looks? Thank you. Hello my little fuckers. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Frederick, wears a raincoat in his last video, even though he's inside chin. And if you're new here, just sit down, get some popcorn, cause we're about to, this video's about to be very, very long, I think. My Asian mind is predicting this to be like, at least 15 minutes, so let's just start. By the title of this video, you should know what this is. So basically, I saw an Instagram ad of this color changing hair wax, and I was like, hmm. You know, I like that. And I've never bought anything from Instagram. I've always thought like, oh, these ads, they're just, you know, basic. I don't care for them. I do not need a light up portable moon for photography. Why? I don't need any iPhone cords. I have five already. It's fine. It's fine. But this one, it was new because I saw a man's hair go from black to purple. And I just, I wanted that. So I ordered it. It was about $15. This video is not sponsored, by the way, because why would it be? And I had to wait two weeks, two weeks for this product to ship because it came from Korea. And it's called Hair Coloring Material from Mofa Jang. Let me just beauty goo this real quick for you. And basically, I'm gonna try it out today because I feel like it. Now going into this, I'm just realizing that I paid $15 to make a YouTube video basically because I first idea was make a video out of this. And you guys know I've wanted silver hair for a while now, but I don't want to spend a hundred dollars to just get it because I don't know how it's gonna look yet. So on the instructions it says, after the net hair, take a small amount of mud in the palm of your hand circle, rubbing uniform, try to get on your finger, and then gently pull the finger form from the hair root, from the bottom up to smear evenly. I don't know what went wrong going from like Korean to English, but this not really grammatically correct, is it? Children do not touch. All right, let me just. Fine, fine. It's water soluble, by the way. It's temporary. Um, lasting, shaping, strong shape. Bring hair, shiny and unique personality. So we're gonna we're gonna give hair personalities now. All right, fine. Let's give you some quick ASMR moment because of that last video I made last week. Mmm. Yes. So it's sealed, making me use my nails that I don't have. Oh God. Ooh. So it smells pretty, um, hair salon-y, I guess. It just smells like, like hair gel. It's nothing special. And it's pretty, uh, muddy. They, that, they got that right. And because I'm cheap and I paid $15 for this, I'm gonna use the product on here. Because I know people don't wanna admit it, but guess what? Everyone does it, and if you don't, you're living a lie. By the way, I haven't washed my hair in two days for this video, so we'll just see what happens. And yes, I wore a gray sweatshirt solely for the purpose of this video. And we're just gonna pray that this doesn't get on my bed. So let me just throw this in the trash can before anything bad happens. I'm just gonna pull it back, like a little bit. I'm just gonna pull it back a little bit there. So I am rubbing between my hands. Let me just, that's not inappropriate at all, Frederick. What are you talking about? And it's pretty uh, silvery, actually. It's not just gray. I see some sheen inside of it. By the way, I'm gonna try this after I wash my hair because I want to try this twice for you guys. But if this goes well, you might see, oh, damn. Oh, wait, this might not be enough product for me. So far, it feels like hair wax. Definitely giving me that old, like, I am your grandfather vibes. Hold on, this is definitely not enough wax for me. This just, it just disappeared. I don't know where it went. Um, yeah, definitely like grandpa vibes for now. And uh, now my hands are stained. Ooh, wait, this would make a great highlighter. We'll get back to that. <laughs> you should know exactly where this is gonna go now that I've said that. This doesn't seem like an everyday use thing um, because if you plan to change your hair color, you're definitely gonna go through this pretty quickly, I presume. Cause I saw some girls in the video like, and they, they like scooped the whole thing out and put it on their hair and it didn't even cover everything. But so far, I'm not mad at this. I just can't really tell cause my camera mirror is not that large. Let me just like try to zoom you in a little bit more. We're gonna get real close, you guys, real close. I mean, I can't really tell if I've actually covered it or not. It still looks a little black on the camera. Let me just like 
put some more in. I don't think I would wear this to school. It seems a little bit too waxy. And I thought it'd be matte, but it's still kind of sticky because I have to use like a lot of product. Like I am trying to drag my hand through this and it's just, it's very, very sticky. Let me just say that much. And now I can't like, yeah, this shit is not moving. Once it's set, oh wait, oh shoot, I think it's starting to dry down. Oh God. Like see how this is just a big ass chunk of hair that's been... I don't even know what to call this. It's just clumped together. I'm going in with even more product on the tips because I want to get those frosted tips, man. I don't know why, but it just doesn't seem like full coverage. It seems more like medium coverage for all you beauty gurus out there. And uh, definitely, <laughs> this definitely is a wax because I can jab someone with this right now. Do I want to get a comb? Ugh, I don't know if I want to get a comb or not. Okay. I didn't know what I was expecting. I just thought this would color my hair instantly and that, then we'd be done, but this? But I mean, the goal here was to see if I look good in this. So now I don't know. All right, I'm going in with even more to try to build this up. All right, so I just realized that I'm only getting like the top of my hair. Cause look at this shit. I have so much more to go. That can't get that. This is gonna take forever. Yeah, I just have to like pat this in every crevice. Oh shit, I got on my. See, I knew this would happen. I get it right there and now I have to wash that off after. Ugh. Should have done this at the bathroom. Why do I do these? Why do I do. Th Why do I do the stupidest things? Alright, you know what? Since we're here already, let me just. That's probably a little bit too much, but I got this like sheen on my hair. I don't want to see how this looks like on my cheeks. But I'm a beauty guru. Gotta put it down the nose, obviously. Don't forget the cupid bow. And then your chin. And then the brow bone. Brow bone. Let's get on the glasses too for their brow bones. Shoot, oh wait. Oh no, this is gonna make me break out. Please don't make me break out. And then we just pat it in. All right, so now that we have a mess, I think what I'm gonna do is let this dry for a little bit. And now I've lost, I've lost two strands of hair now. They're gone, me. And I don't know how, but this feels so soft on my hands right now, it's, and it's like not even sticky. So if you wanted to be like Space Girl for a day, do, do this because it definitely, it definitely is matte. All right, so I can confirm on the skin it's matte. This would work great for a galaxy look. Oh, wait, hold on. What if I did that? <laughs> Makeup tutorial. But on the hair though, uh, I don't know why it's not drying. So I'm go. I will be back. Comb this out a little bit. Figure out what happened, and I'll I'll see you guys in a little bit. Now, how the hell do I turn off? Oh, how do I turn off my camera? Mm. Mm. I just want you to know, my mic was off for the last 10 minutes, which means I have to do the last half of the video all over again. I'm so pissed, but I'm doing it for you guys. So keep in mind, I've done this already, and I'm still so mad at this. I hate it. But basically, I came back, and I colored in you know my sideburns I want to see how it looked this this looks amazing I love this I love this so much I feel like a beauty guru Sephora come hire your boy <laughs> but I tried hair drying it to make it less um, sticky and definitely like after I guess the 30 minutes I've been on my bed it's it's dry now um still chunky i don't know why it's a thing doesn't happen with regular hair wax and i should know because i have it but i've never put this much hair wax ever on my hair so this might be the result of what happens but the main point is this like i want you to see how difficult it is to comb through my hair oh god that was tragic and it does transfer a little bit it is transferring a little bit on my hands too and i did wash them when they say it's water soluble it definitely is but i recommend warm water because i had 20 layers on my hands i had to get rid of overall though i bought this to test if i could look good in silver hair which now that i think about it i could have just bought hairspray you know i was just looking at my nose it's very prominent right now it gives me some of that caucasian nose you know because us asians have pig noses for some reason Sorry, it's just, I've been bullied as a kid about that. <laughs> I'm not even taking this seriously. But what I'm confused about is like, in the videos, they just took a dollop and then rubbed it in between their hands, ruffled it through their hair, and it was like all purple. So I'm just, I wanna know what went wrong. Maybe I did it wrong. If you guys have any suggestions, 
Let me know in the comments. I think I'm gonna try doing this again with um, wet hair this time and tell you how that goes. So no need to comment that, please do not do that. I'm gonna also try to use less product, but if anyone has used this before, please tell me like what the right way is, because I don't think I did this right. The instructions couldn't really understand it because that was not English, that was English. But like, oh, what bugs me the most is that you don't have individual strands of hair. You know when your hair is really like oily and when you brush it through, you can like see where you brushed because they, your hair like kind of bundles together. That's this to the extreme. I can't even brush my hair through this. That's how bad it is. Like my hair, this just clump together and it's not moving anytime soon. And uh, can we just talk about how oily my forehead looks? Thank you. I'm also noticing like every time I brush my hair through, I can see like little dust particles falling out. It's mainly because I have a huge ass light in front of me, but like that's definitely not dandruff because the dandruff is sealed forever in my hair because of this hair wax. Like, as you can tell, my fingertips are getting a little bit glowy for the gods. But like, my hair doesn't feel right anymore. Like I haven't washed it in two days and it's, it's like bone dry. I want to do a hair mask now because I don't think it's gonna recover. This doesn't feel right. This isn't even Dorito texture. It's like freaking crusty crab french fry texture at this point. What the heck is this? Actually, no, this isn't dry because I'm feeling through my hair right now and if I squeeze like the chunks of hair, I can feel the hair wax like squishing. I can hear it. So it's still tacky, which is not my jam. Like the instructions, they weren't fucking kidding when they said this was mud because this literally is mud. Like, oh my God. I think I just made a right angle in my hair. Yeah, look at that. I just folded my hair onto itself. And while we're here, let me just see what other shits and giggles I can do. Maybe I can try, ow, never mind. Okay, so since I said it this way, it's, it's not gonna move the other way. Oh, oh Jesus. This is giving me extreme flashbacks to my hairstyle, like, <laughs> like two years ago. It's not that big of a difference, but now I kind of like let it grow down. But I mean, if we just like cut off this part, that doesn't look that bad, does it? Right? Right. And let me just give you an up close of what this looks like. <sighs> A little tragic. Yeah, I missed a spot there. And I missed a spot here. Cause yeah, I kept with the glasses on. And if I turn around, I didn't bother getting that part. But, oh wait, hold on. I have hair on my eyebrows. <gasps> oh, hold on a second. This is the last step I need to take to become the Asian grandpa that I am aspiring to be. Yes, yes, yes. This is exactly what I wanted. Turn me into an Asian grandpa. Should I put on my eyebrows? All right, well, it's kind of messy. Just wipe that away, but Asian grandpa. All right, well, I guess that's all I have for you today. Um, <laughs> I look so stupid. Oh, why'd I do this to myself? These eyebrows are not going anywhere anytime soon. And don't even dare judge me for adding more to my nose. You freaking people who use makeup, you, you, you put too much on your nose all the time. This is like a ball of light whenever I look at your Instagram pic. All right, well, that's all I have for today. Next week, you might see me with gray hair because I'm going to try this one more time to see if I can get it right. If you enjoyed, give us your like, leave a comment down below, ready to subscribe because post videos every Sunday. God, oh, why did I do that to my eyebrows? They, they feel terrible. It literally, I can't, I can't, I need to take it off. All right, so I'm going to make this quick, but uh, basically I had to wash my hair and put on a hair mask because... Holy hell, my hair was dry after that. But uh, it did wash out all the way. It didn't take that long. My bathtub, the water was gray. But would I recommend this product? Girl, no, I wouldn't. <laughs> I wanna know what went wrong, what went wrong. All right, that's enough of this update. Back to the video. I need to go. I love you guys and everything is less than three.